my name is Eddie Tofpik. I'm Head of Technical Analysis and Senior Markets Analyst at ADM Investor Service International Limited. And here is your daily technical analysis of LME 3 month copper and aluminium. I'll start with LME 3 month copper. A lower bearish long black marabozo yesterday, coming as it did after the previous session's indecisive doji cross. Over the last two weeks we've had the market reach up and achieve target X in the 10,400 area, the target for the bullish halfway hesitation stroke mission move higher, originating from the start of 2021, as well as the projected 50% Fibonacci line at 10,575, closing over the former but not over the latter. Yesterday was the result of the market trying higher still and failing. The recent questions the market has been asking itself seem to be resolving. No immediate attempt to try higher and reach target X1 in the 11,000 area. The potential should the mid-April today action have become a bull flag. Will therefore retire it after today. As I said two days ago and repeated yesterday, I suspect either the strength of the move up over the projected 50% Fibonacci line or down through the September 2011 high at 10,182 may show an initial idea, but to beware of false breaks. Well, so far, yesterday has broken down properly through the 10182 area, halting at the trio of supports from 2011, the March high at 99.99, the April high at 99.47, and the July high at 99.07. So far today, a lower open, but a seeming base of operations at the trio of supports previously mentioned, 99.99, 99.47, and 99.07. Meanwhile, the cap is the February 2011 high. LME 3 month aluminium. Gapping lower, second bearish black crow yesterday, since filled, and a suitable follow on lower to the previous session's bearish dark cloud cover pattern. The drop was halted by the upper trend line, currently at 23.98, of the old ascending triangle pattern that started the current move higher back between February and April. All this comes in the shadow of last week's outside week. So far today, a lower open and an attempt at testing the upper trend line, but it is very, very cautious as it looks like an indecisive spinning top right now. Thank you for listening. This short version broadcast gives essential market patterns and consequences. Please be aware of the risk disclaimer posted with this broadcast. Copyright is Eddie Topic and ADM Investor Services International Limited. And here comes the final piece.